Powered by Ford. Go further. Hey everyone, this is Todd Hazelton from Techno Buffalo. We're checking out BlackBerry's Dev Alpha B unit and it's running an alpha version. So this isn't final hardware or final software that'll be revealed on January 30th, although we do have a good idea of what's going on here. Uh, as you lift up the lock screen, you'll be able to see what's available on the home screen. If you swipe left, it's a BlackBerry hub, and this is where you're going to see Twitter messages, Facebook messages, your emails, notifications, and then you can search and compose uh, directly from there, so it's always available. Here's the browser. We already have it open. It's HTML5 based. Rim is telling us it's got the highest scores of any HTML5 browser. We've got Techno Buffalo loaded. It's moving really quickly. Actually, everything's really quick. Uh, the camera's really cool. Hold your finger down uh, to focus on a specific spot and then uh, tap and go. There's also a time feature, so say we want to take a picture of that. We grab it, the memory was low, but that's okay. So now this will move back in time, and if you look closely, you'll see it's actually grabbed photos from before and after I took the picture. So say you're focused on BlackBerry, that, actually that one looks better. Grab it, and you've got it saved, so that's great for if somebody has their eyes closed. Now if we go to a photo, you can quickly share it using NFC, Bluetooth, DVM, uh, or other social networks. Now the cool thing about NFC and BlackBerry 10 is uh, for things like adding a BlackBerry contact in BBM, you can tap your phone uh, to easily do that, which is really cool as opposed to in the past where you had to maybe enter in the BBM number manually. Familiar icons. Um, the new thing is BlackBerry World, no longer BlackBerry App World, because it has music and video as well, uh, and games of course. Here you can see the highlights of the movies that are out or available, and that'll always be changing top grossing apps and games. Carrier billing is supported as it has been in the past, but in-app purchases are also supported with carriers. So within notifications, there will be a, a feature called BlackBerry Balance that lets you quickly switch between work and play modes. Uh, so if your IT department wants specific applications, it'll limit you to them, and then you can always have your applications. Now, the cool thing about that is you can actually, on the weekends, lock the work mode so that you don't see your work calendar events, your emails, and can actually enjoy time off. So that's a quick look here at BlackBerry 10. This is Todd Hazelton with Techno Buffalo. Again, not final software, not the final hardware. We'll bring you that on January 30th. We're on location at CES 2013 in Las Vegas, hanging out at the Ford booth. No one likes getting lost when you're driving or having to ask for directions. Ford vehicles with sync and optional voice activated navigation help solve that problem. Get turn by turn directions over your car's audio system so you know where you're turning next. To save time, you can even plan your route ahead by saving an address as a favorite or searching through your previous destinations. Thanks again to Ford for powering this Techno Buffalo CES special and for giving us a behind the scenes at CES 2013.